Welcome into the recap of the White Sox pathetic 7-2 loss to the 10 games under 500 Arizona Diamondbacks at Guaranteed Rate Field. Tonight, I'm David Kaplan. I got a text from one of my kids, my son Nick and his wife Maggie. Hey, we went to the White Sox game today. Is it good when the other team scores six runs in the second inning? No, Nick and Maggie, it's not. Look, Johnny Cueto's been outstanding. Anyone's entitled to have an off night. But where in the hell is your offense? I watch Arizona make amazing defensive plays. Uh, Dalton Varsho, Alec Thomas, Alec Thomas again. The third baseman makes a great spear. And when the Sox get men on, double play. And it seems to me, without making any type of changes, whether it was at the deadline, whether it's the hitting coach, they just are resigned to their fate. And that's the sad thing to watch. I'm not kidding you. This is a team that started the season with legitimate World Series hopes and aspirations. And instead, they're going to end up not in the playoffs. It's just, it's pathetic to watch. I don't see any fire from this team. The offense that was supposed to be so good is awful and nothing ever changes. We'll see what they do in the offseason, but I don't see a scenario where they make the playoffs. I don't. But the fact that you can't ever come up with a big offensive performance, and find a way to score five, six, seven runs, bail out a starter who's been nothing but sensational all year long, and all you keep doing is looking like a team going through the motions. That's just a fact. Sebi Zavala got you a couple hits, two for A.J. Pollock. That was about the extent of the offense. We saw Aloy Jimenez limping after he ran down to first base. They let him stay in the game. Will he play tomorrow? I would bet not, but who knows? Again, they lose 7-2 to to a lousy Arizona team, but a team that came in here and showed you some fire, some passion, and when they got a chance in the second inning, they broke it open. Six on the board. A double with the bases loaded. Scored three. And then a two-run home run. Ball game over. Six nothing. You knew. White Sox? They ain't coming back tonight. So sorry, Nick and Maggie, that you had to spend your hard-earned money on tickets to watch that horseshit performance. Sox lose. Twins are up 8 nothing. They'll fall all the way down into third now. And we'll see what happens with Cleveland tonight. They're going to be five out by the end of the evening. And a game behind the Twins. Take that.